So migraines, severe debilitating migraines. I've had them since I was six years old, but as I've gotten older, they sporadically came. However, once I had my first child 13 years ago, right after having her is when they became chronic, a daily issue. Um, what I've tried for all of my migraines, I've been to four neurologists in state and out of state. I've been to about three acupuncturists I've been to um, the cranial sacral. I've done that one time. I've done medical massage. I've done, and I, I literally do that every two weeks. I do. I've been to over over four chiropractors, so five chiropractors. I've done been to four um, physical therapists. I've been to goodness uh, three ear, nose, and throat doctors. Uh, I've been to at least two headache and pain centers. I've been to um, other specialists that said they help with migraines. And um, I've actually been to get do Reiki, the energy work, the Pilates, meditation. I've done literally everything out there physically. The level of pain I'm already, typically daily I'm at a nine or 10. Um, I have those throughout the entire day uh, within b b the pain starts here in my temples and then it radiates down to my ears through my jaws this hurts severely then my neck both sides of my neck and then it shoots down all the way down into my shoulders really really bad and then the back of my my these wings on both sides that's where it goes uh, pain 10, 20 if, if you, you can go up to 20. Um, goodness, I've done every medication there is to offer. I've done Botox. Um, I'm literally taking 1800 milligrams of ibuprofen every day. Sometimes I'll throw in some migraine, I mean uh, Tylenol. Muscle relaxers. Um, I, do, I now currently do edibles before I go to bed because I can't sleep at all. So the edibles still does not take the pain away. It just helps me sleep. Um, I've done, I do, I'm a herbalist, so I'm doing every herbal remedy, all the teas, all everything you can think of. I do nutraceuticals. I'm holistic now, so I'm nutraceuticals, um, everything, everything. I'll be here all day, but I've done everything. Uh, fatigue. Fatigue is my second symptom. I never have energy. I never have anything to take care of my children, go to work, barely can even go to the restroom. My husband literally has to help me out of the bed and take me and sit me on top of the toilet stool. No joke, this is every day. He has to help feed me my food. Sometimes I can't even chew my food, so he has to make me smoothies. So I'm very thin because I don't have an appetite majority of the time because of the pain. And then the second part is because of my jaws, the pain in my jaws, it barely, I can barely chew my food. So I'm a, I'm a smoothie eater um, with beside him picking my food up to help me eat because of the lack of energy and the fatigue. So I'm a fatigue on top of fatigue because I'm not getting sleep and then the fatigue just draining me. I start with maybe two on a little level from one to 10. I wake up one or two, takes me about maybe two or three hours to get to a level eight. My peak is maybe eight and then I drop right back down drastically. My third, the pain, the, my, my, neck, my neck and shoulder and back pain is what I am really, really having a horrible time with. It hurts for me to lay down and sleep. So majority of the time I, I sleep sitting up against the back of the wall with pillows because my neck and back hurts so bad. So laying on either side, it hurt extremely. Uh, bending down, looking, picking up anything, turning, trying to exercise, try to hold my babies. I got two babies. Uh, it hurts extremely bad. Um, my profession, I'm looking down and it hurts to look down. So I'm barely working now because I can barely do my job. So neck, back, shoulder pain, 25 pain level, just like the migraines. Lastly, um, the pain. I was in a car accident about two months ago and since the car accident, my right side, I've been having shooting pain from my neck, shoulder, arm, 
all the way down to my buttocks, really, really bad, my thigh, and it shoots all the way down, radiates to my foot. And it's a numbing, numbing and tingling sensation. I can, I can barely drive. Sometimes it gets so bad that my husband has to drive. I'm right-handed and right-footed, and that's the gas and, and the hand that I drive with. So sometimes I can't do that. Sometimes I have a hard time opening and flexing my hand with the arm pain. Um, it's just horrible. <laughs> Everything has gone downhill. That's a 10. It's a 10, like with, with the migraine, it shoots up to a 10, but with when the migraine is like at a five or six, it's about the same pain as the, the migraine. So if it goes to 10, this goes to 10. So how I've been doing, great. I have improved uh, drastically more than what I thought. Um, percentage wise, I feel like I've gotten 90% better. Um, I stopped two days ago all of my heavy um, medical pain medicines. So I've been two days off of my pain medicines. My fatigue has been raised, I would say maybe, so on a scale, I would say eight out of 10. Eight, 10 being the best, eight. So my fatigue in the morning, I'm able to get up, no medication, get started with my day with my children, go straight to work. Uh, my shoulder, neck, and back pain has drastically um, increased with improvement, so the pain has decreased a lot. I would say about 80%. I'm 80% better as far as the pain in my neck, back, and shoulder. Uh, also, I, used, I was having shooting pain down the right side of my arm and my leg and foot. That has stopped completely. Now I just feel like maybe some throbbing here and there, but the shooting has stopped. So I all, all, all together, I, I have drastically improved. And I, my expectation, uh, as I told you, it was maybe just 50%, but I feel like I'm at 90. I am, my body is starting to detox from all the heavy medications these last two days, and I just feel different. I feel alive. It's impacted my life. The migraines have kept me down from playing with my kids, helping my oldest daughter with her homework, uh, going places with them, cooking dinner, cleaning the house. I, I miss work, I call my clients and have to reschedule so much. Can't go to the grocery store, sunny outside, I can't go outside and get air and sun. It's just everything. So now, within the last two or three days, especially with the weather being very nice yesterday, after work, I went straight to pick my kids up. We went straight to the park for about two hours, then went to the grocery store after that, then came home, gave him a bath, and helped my husband with dinner. I haven't cooked dinner in like almost three or four years. Uh, and I've been feeling like a horrible person, horrible mother, horrible wife. So yesterday was like the, t the tip of the iceberg for me. It just gave me so much more hope than what I already came in with. So I'm, I'm grateful to God that he has sent you to help me. <laughs> Whew, I tried so hard on Christmas just of last year, but I was in bed all day. The last time I was actually able to play with my kiddos would be never. I have a two-year-old and a four-year-old and I have not been able to play with them at all. Uh, my oldest daughter is 12 and I was, maybe when she was first born about 12 years ago, I was able to goo goo and gaga with her, but after that, it's been downhill. So, you'll, everybody that's around us will always hear, Mommy, when are you gonna be able to play with us again? When are you gonna be able to, Mommy, can you, why don't you, oh. And it's torn me down, but yesterday, I'm back. So, how I'm feeling now, uh, versus when we first met, I feel is there's a significant improvement. Uh, definitely with the migraines, I would say 80% better. Uh, with my fatigue, I would say about 92% better. Much, much, much more energy. Uh, with my neck, shoulder, and back pain, I would say that's about maybe 80% better. Definitely have more range of motion. I'm able to work more, be with my children more, my husband more. I started back school, basically got my life back. Um, I really feel like I'm in, I am close to being 100% better. I feel like I have nerve pain uh, on the right side of my body. I would say that got 30% better, so 30% improvement. Um, it doesn't shoot as much and it's not as numb and the tingling feeling like I used to have. 
I did have a car accident literally three weeks before I, I come to you. So uh, I was in horrible, horrible condition. <laughs> so how I've improved according to my lifestyle, uh, I am a hair loss practitioner and a hairstylist. And I'm literally bending over the bowl 90% of the day, repetition with blow drying, combing, flat ironing, bending over neck, looking down all the time. Um, I'm able to do that much longer than, I, than what I was, so I'm able to work a lot more. Um, I'm able to bend down more, um, play with my children, pick my children up. I'm able to run and play without straining my back or my neck or something. It's just always popping and getting out of control. So um, I, 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 feel, I feel a lot better. Oh, goodness. So as far as your services goes, I definitely recommend your services as far as anybody um, suffering from debilitating migraines, neck, back, or shoulder pain, um, any type of nerve pain. I definitely recommend Dr. Raman. Um, I feel it was a great investment. I uh, learned a lot of things about my body that I was not aware of, uh, especially going through uh, physical therapy that was recommended. Uh, I've seen a great improvement, so um, I can't complain.